The difference between best friends and regular friends. Best friends can get away with a lot more than regular friends can. For instance, if I'm eating something and you know I'm about to finish it and it's like the last bite and my best friend goes and it falls out my hand, I'm gonna laugh. But now if my friend does that, oh, I might just kill you. The cemetery is hiring! The cemetery is hiring! Don't mind if I fucking do! Ugh, it's Johnny Big Feet. Hey, my feet aren't that big. Damn you, Johnny Big Feet! Hey, um, can people fly? That's a shame. Okay, they said they love you and they miss you a lot. Aw, I miss them too. Tell them I have to sell their shit though. Uh-uh, uh-uh, tell that bitch not to touch, touch my shit at all. Okay, they said D -d do not disturb their belonging. That's not how they talk. What they really said. Yeah, say exactly what the fuck I said. I need this bitch to know. They said not to touch that shit. See here, I knew the fuck he would say some shit like that. Because I'm not keeping that. That's dead people shit. I bet. I'm finna haunt your ass since you need a motherfucker to be around. He's... He's finna haunt you. I'm, I'm sorry. Hey, babe, uh, where are you been? You left me at the goddamn McDonald's! I wasn't loving it! Yeah, things haven't been going too well with me and my girlfriend. I hired an acting coach to help us save our relationship. I'd like to start out with some acting exercises. You told me there would be no exercise! Babe, calm down. This guy cost us $200. What the fuck? Well, look who it is. Mr. and Mrs. Literal. Hello! Hello. You two have been married a while. Any plans for having kids in the future? Well, it's funny you mention it. We have one in the oven right now. Congratula- Knock knock! Who is there? A mirror! I am lonely. I wish people would be nice to me. Your wish is stupid. Sir, is this your car? Nope, it's yours. I'm looking it up on your laptop, alright? The battery's dead. I'll look it up on my phone. Dad, I know this doesn't look good, but you gotta trust me, I can explain. Simply Tasha here. To support me, consider buying some merch. The designer of all your favorite characters. To buy your favorite design, just click this link to access everything. Thanks, and enjoy the rest of the video. Officer, please, I need your help. Hi, sir, what's the emergency? My son has gone missing. Okay, sir, what's his name? Sir? Hello, sir. Sir, what's his name? Sir, I need to know your son. Shut up, I'm thinking. Sorry, but your father's no longer with us. Oh, no. He's at a different hospital. Oh, thank God. I don't know how much longer he has. What? In the hospital. They're gonna move him to a different one. Oh, okay. He's super ill. What do you mean? Like, he's dope. Like, he's, like, super chill. Oh, for sure, yeah. He's super cool. Yeah, he's gonna die. Sir, I want you to try these on and tell me if you can see. Oh my god, what are these things? I can see for the first time in years. New invention called glasses. Baby, so those things cured your blindness? Yeah, babe, they... Wow. What? It is over. You are hideous as f I've been walking around with you? Hey. Me and you, we gotta talk. Uh, sure, um, wh wh what's up? Did you kill my father? <sighs> I I'm sorry, look, I promise it will never happen again. Well, of course it won't happen again, that's the point. Please let me into heaven. And why should I do that? Because of what Candace said. C candace Who's Candace? W what do you mean, Candace? Candace, get in your mouth! It was a pretty good totally one. Totally worth it. Dad! There's a monster under my bed! There's nothing under... Wait. A mirror? <laughs> I got you! Get it? You're the monster! Uh, Dad? Where's your reflection? So tell me, what are you afraid of? I know it's a little strange, but... I'm afraid of letters. Letters? Yeah. Are you? <laughs> oh. 
I see. Hey, Dad, can I hang out with Tommy today? Uh, do you want me to say yes? How was this a yes? No, no. Jeez, okay, no. Louder. Jesus, no. Tommy, I'm sorry, bro. Who that? Pizza delivery. Oh, nice. Dad, it's been 20 years. Oh, shit. Listen, you lost $400 of your mother's money. She beats your ass. Then your dad beats your ass. Then you go to your room, and on top of your bed, you find a $400. Do you give it back? 911, hello, I think my friend just died. Okay, I understand. First things first, make sure he's dead, okay? Okay, I got it. <laughs> okay, now what? What the fuck? Speeches in anime always be like, You don't have enough power to stop me. <laughs> For all of my life. Wait, how are you standing up? I've always been called weak. First my father. You're too weak, son. Then my grandma. You're weak, grandbaby. And even my own dog. You're weak, bark bark. And I almost believe them. But thanks to all the friends I've made, I've realized that friendship is my true power. How did you get so strong? Did you know that atoms never touch each other? And since we're made of atoms, we've never touched anything in our entire lives. So to answer your question, officer, no, I did not punch that kid. Four men are in the hospital waiting room because their wives are having babies. A nurse goes up to the first guy and says, Congratulations, you're a father of twins. The man says, That's a crazy coincidence. I work for the Minnesota Twins. The nurse says to the second guy, Congratulations, you're the father of triplets. The man says, That's a crazy coincidence. I work for the 3M company. The nurse tells the third guy, Congratulations, you're the father of quadruplets. The man says that's a strange coincidence, I work for the Four Seasons Hotel. The last man is freaking out and banging his head against the wall. The nurse asked him, what's wrong, are you okay? He said, no, I'm screwed, I work for 7up. Dude, you left your child at my house. Babysit, I'm horrible with children, you know this. Okay, fine. So, uh, you like Game of Thrones? You into politics? You like politics? No? How do you feel about abortion? You, you like it? You don't like it? Just forget I said that. It's... Stop. No, really stop. Please. Oh, well, that was a strange episode of Twilight Zone. Guess you're not a big fan of TV, are you? Honestly, I prefer Nickelodeon. Hey, man. Hey, Max. What's going on? So, I got good news, and I got bad news. Okay, give me the bad news. It's not gonna make much sense. I'm a man! I can take the bad news! Give me the bad news! Well, it died on the way here. What is that? Well, what's the good news? You know that bird you wanted for your birthday? Yeah? Well, I got it! No! Yeah! <laughs> Thanks, man. Wait, hold- Hi, welcome to the bank. Put the money in the bag. Ugh. No. I have a wife and a son. Okay, I- look, I appreciate your situation, so Wait, hang on, that's not right. I have a knife and a gun. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Sorry, my mistake. Ah! Ugh, oh, I hate being so attractive. Girls always cat call me when I'm biking. She wants me. We need to break up. We need to break up. We need to break up. We need, we need to break up. We should break up. I think that we sh I think that we should break up. I think that we should break up. Listen, I think that we need All to- All right, I get it. <gasps> look at that butterfly. It's one that disguises itself to look like a predator. Eh, I don't see it. Hey, good morning, mom. Mom, uh, are, are you okay? Good morning, sweetie. Oh, I thought you were—I thought you were mad or something. You didn't take the trash out last night. No, I didn't. Well, you're probably just tired from school. Yeah, that's true. But it's summer vacation. That is also true. But we all make mistakes sometimes. Give me a hug. You're hugging a little tight, mom. But you never took the chicken out the freezer. Am I the only one who has family members who come around like once in a thousand years and they're like, "Oh, Sammy, you look like you've gotten fat." Mary, you look like you're about to fucking fossilize. Shut the fuck up before I fucking cremate you, you crusty dusty dinosaur. You've recently lost someone close to you, perhaps a family member, name beginning with F. Father. Father, yes. He's here with us now. What's he saying? He wants to tell you that... 
He's disappointed. Oh. And also, you left the stove on. Right. Hmm. How did he die? Gas explosion. Ah. Dad! What's up, buddy? There's a demon under my bed! No, there's not. Would it make you feel better if I checked? Mm hmm. Alright. Oh, hey, Frank. Brian? What's up, dude? Yo, I haven't seen you since I was like 10, dude. You're still working for the big man downstairs, I see. Uh, you know me, man. Listen, you mind laying off my son off there? He's a little bit of a puss puss. Oh, that's kind of cute. I like that. You call him your son. Yeah, he's the mailman's kid. You didn't know that? What do you mean? Yeah, dude, I was actually there. I was waiting for your daughter to come to sleep so I could scare her. But instead, I got Mrs. Moans a lot and mailman Steve making a paper boy right above me. All right, man. All right, man. Yep, nothing there. You're good. Are you sure? Hey, Billy, you want to play Naked Twister? <laughs> hey, buddy, what have you got there? I did a drawing of you and Mummy. Oh, Timmy. We're getting a divorce. Okay, so there's your receipt, and have a good day. All right, bye. Love you. I didn't mean it. I love you, too. I thought you'd never say it. Kiss me! Okay, but... Jeremy, where's your homework, man? Shit, um... My dog ate your homework, took my homework, and wrote all of the really bad answers on it. What? <laughs> I mean, my dog ate my homework. <laughs> yeah, that's what I thought. <laughs> oh, Jeremy, you're a fool, bro. Seriously, the only he would think is some shit. If you multiply by zero... Hey, what's that guy doing? Oh, uh, that guy's schizophrenic. Right now, he's driving. Wait, so he really thinks he's driving? Yep, everything's real to him. What's he doing now? He just stepped into an elevator. This box contains your greatest fear. Do your worst. I fear nothing. And that's exactly what's inside. Nothing! <laughs>Wow, our prisoners are running great this week. We should, we should give them a Christmas present. Like, I don't know, candy canes or- Candy canes? No, what? <laughs> You're gonna spike their blood sugar. Yeah, that's a good point. Um, how about sugar-free candy canes? That's a great idea. Yeah, you, you are sharp, dude. <laughs> Dad, there's a monster under my bed. There's nothing under, wait, a mirror? <laughs> I got you! Get it? You're the monster! Uh, Dad, where's your reflection? Repeat after me. I can do this. I can do this. I'm ready to burn some calories. I'm ready to burn some calories. I'm done eating fast food and drinking alcohol. I'm ready to burn some calories. All right. You have one more wish. One more wish? I, I don't even know what to think of. Dude, think of all the good we could do with this one wish. World peace, end world hunger, no more war. You're right. Genie, I'm ready for my last wish. Go on. I wish for an anime girlfriend. Get the fuck on the ground, buddy. I'm not gonna say it again. Get on that. What? They called us here because he's about to jump. Oh, oh! Grandpa, Grandpa. What's that, Sonny? I found a nickel on the ground. Well, that's just wonderful. Remember to put it in your piggy bank. I also found a key buried in your backyard. Oh, uh, well, don't pay no mind to that key. Uh, Grandpa doesn't know anything about that. And then I found an abandoned shed that the key unlocks. Oh, uh, that, that sure is strange. And then I went in the shed, and I found a hidden door that leads underground. You shouldn't be, you shouldn't be doing that now. And then I found a shotgun, and a bunch of skeletons, and one of them had Grandma's clothes on it. I miss Grandma. Uh, me, me too. Crazy how she just uh, disappeared like that. <laughs> and then there was one guy that looked all tired and hungry, and he begged me for help. Well, what'd you do? I shot him. Well, that's just wonderful. The difference between best friends and regular friends. If you fall as your friend, I will help you up, and then I might, you know, giggle or something. But as your best friend, if you fall, I am going to be crying laughing, and once I finish laughing, then I'll help you get up. Hey, Dad, can I hang out with Tommy today? Uh, do you want me to say yes? How was this a yes? No, no. Jeez, okay, no.
Jesus. No! Tommy, I'm sorry, bro! Alright, we need you to release the hostages without harming them. Well, our clients want you to give them the money and let them escape. I'll handle this. Hey, what if we doubled what they're paying you? Will you stop? I'll take care of this guy. What if we tripled your salary? Would you stop? Yeah, nice try. You said triple? All right, describe yourself in one word. Tired. Fuck, can you do that? Well, well, it, it says here you're good at mathematics. So what's, what's 69 times 420? 37. That wasn't even close. Yeah, but it was quick. Fuck, you're hired. You're a bitch. I know. Well, I ask you this, your honor. Why did the chicken cross the road? To get to the other side. <laughs> but that doesn't quite add up. Why would the chicken need to cross the road? It has no motive. Unless... The chicken is the killer. <gasps> well, do the math. What's five times five? I, I don't know. Well, then look it up. All right, jeez. Ah! Let's just use my phone. <laughs> Shoot, puppy, moon. Uh, give me your phone. This is the best option. <laughs> oh, yes, daddy. Don't tell your mother. Double my allowance. Okay, so I just got my DNA test results back and, uh... I'm surprised. <laughs> I surprised. I'm dad. <laughs> That's the funny thing. You're not. Is there something you want to tell me? How can I help you today, Mrs. Mister. Mrs. Mister. What can I do you for? Um, you called me in. Yes, yes, yes I did. Yes I did. <laughs> I knew that. Let's have a look in here. What's going on with you? Oh. This is not good at all. What? Oh, how bad is it? You know what, I'm just gonna have to be honest with you. Not great. Oh no, I know she's my daughter and she, she is only four, but like, how is this supposed to be a cat? <sighs> Idiot. We have your actual test results here as well, don't worry. Okay, hang on, these are my results. Um, oh, and apparently I have scurvy. <laughs> Who knew? Oh, please, can you just give it to me straight? Whoa, we, we don't address people by their sexual orientation here. Doctor, am I sick or not? Yeah, dude, you're sick. Oh. No, no, you're not sick, but you are suffering from a gunshot wound in your left arm. Oh! I mean oh. shoulder. Oh, what the hell is wrong with you? <laughs> well, scurvy, apparently. Oh. <laughs> Brilliant. Next! Hey, babe, can we talk for a second? Uh, Jerry, I'm gonna have to call you back. What is it, babe? There's something I need to tell you. What's going on? I'm pregnant. Hi, pregnant. I'm dad. <laughs> That's the funny thing. You're not. What? Who's the father? Jerry's the father. <laughs> Alright, son, this is a lie detector. It's gonna beep every time you're not telling the truth. So I'll ask you again. Were you at school today? I already told you, dad. Yeah, of course I was. You sure about that? Okay, okay, okay. I went and had a beer with my friends. You see, this is the kind of behavior I'm talking about. I was never drinking at your age. <laughs> Well, I guess he really is your son. Honey? What the f- Is this patient sexually active? <laughs> With your mom. Triple the dosage. But sir, that could kill him. Just fucking do it! You wanna know what I was thinking? We should start referring to your age as levels. Like I'm level 20. How fucking cool is that? My son died at level 4. <laughs> Noob. Fighter. Ew, a fat, ugly, depressed bitch. What did you just call me? Afraid there's been a terrible accident. Your wife is dead. But she only just went out to get milk. I'm so sorry. I can't. No. No. I can't have coffee without milk, I just can't. So you think you learned your lesson now? Mm -hmm. Yeah, for sure. Kid shows are not to be messed with. Hey guys, what you watching? Oh, we're just watching Peppa Pig. Jeez, guys, uh, isn't this show for babies? <laughs> Don't say it. Say what? Babies? Uh, why is that funny looking fella looking at me? She's coming for you. Oh. I'm Peppa Pig! Yeah! Would you rather speak every language or be able to speak to every- Speak every language? Could you imagine how hard- I got a wife and kids, man. You don't have I'm to so do sorry. this. I'm so sorry. Richard, I'm... kill it. Just kill it already. Please, I swear I won't hurt you. It won't hurt you, I swear. And how do you know? Huh? 
It's not like you could speak to the thing. Yeah, well, uh, about that. All right, Mr. Davis. So tell me, what brings you here today? Well, okay, so I have this this illness where I I can't stop killing my doctors when I when I go for checkups. Put the gun down, Mr. Davis. I really don't want to have to do this, doctor, but I have no choice. There's always a choice, Mr. Davis. I have to kill you. Correct me if I'm wrong, Mr. Davis, but you have to kill doctors. Which you are. See, Mr. Davis, I have an illness of my own. And what is that? I can't stop pretending to be doctors. What? Hey! I, too, have an illness. I can't stop shooting innocents. Hi there. Were you ready to order? Hi, uh, I'll just have the usual. Thanks. Do I know you? No. Okay, yeah, I didn't think so. So then why the fuck would I know what the usual is for you? It's on the menu. It says it's just a chicken sandwich with roasted red peppers and spices. Oh, I'm I am so sorry. I completely forgot that's what we called that. No, okay. it, that's okay. Great. So, Don't worry about it. And what did you want to drink with that? Uh, yeah, I'll have whatever it takes to get you out of my face. Excuse, excuse me? What the fuck did you just say to me? <laughs> no, it's on the, it's on the menu. It says it's just a water with lemon. Oh, gosh, I am so sorry. I keep no, it's, forgetting. it's okay. Where's your girlfriend been? I haven't seen her around. Ah, she went on vacation, dude. No way, where'd she go? I think she said, um, Florida. Oh, she go alone? Uh, uh, she went, she went over with her best friend. Ooh. Could you maybe like set me up with her? Well, her best friend's name is Michael, so. Oh. Yeah, but, you know, she told me he's gay, so I'm not that worried. Oh, well, how, how long have they been gone for? Uh, I think they left like four months ago. Okay, now that I think about it. Uh, guys? What does a pregnancy test look like? No, it's like a thin piece of plastic with a thing on the end of it. Okay, so this is definitely a gun. Whoa! Here's the deal. I'll reveal to you who the killer is with hard evidence if you give me full immunity. I don't know. Well, I'm your only lead. Fine. Full immunity. You're a free man. Who's the killer? Me. Fuck! Best mate Alan just stole your leftover Pepper John's pizza. Well, here's how you're gonna get it back. Step one, you tell Alan that you were literally about to yourself with excitement because it's your grandma's birthday barbecue tell alan he's been invited to the barbecue and the party starts tonight step two alan writes his little bc collector to your grandma's house comes inside says hello goes number two washes his hands and then you smash him over the back of the head with a huge bowl of gorgonzola sweet dreams alan boom step three you immediately come around and gift wrapping paper and tie him to the tree outside then you blindfold grandma hand her a wooden stick and tell her to beat the living shit out of her alan shape pinata like there's no tomorrow boom boom Alan simply pukes up your Papa John's pizza, you pick it up off the ground, and if it's still in okay condition, you take it back home. Well done, mate. Justice has been served. If you have ten cookies and someone asks for two, how many do you have? Ten. Okay, what if someone forcefully takes two cookies? Well, then what do you have? Ten and a dead body. What's that behind your ear? It's a hearing aid! What? Hey, what time is it? It's muffin time! <laughs> time of death, muffin time. The award for best sarcasm goes to this guy. Oh wow, wow. Thank, thank you so much! Honey, I'm pregnant! I can explain. I think we should just be friends. Mother. Ooh, I wonder what this does. Oh, I'm gay now. Huh. Hey, want to see an impression of my dad? Sure. I'm currently running on two hours of sleep, suicidal thoughts, and an Oreo, and I'm ready to fight God or become him. What's your name, sir? My name is Dees. Dees what, sir? Equals five over two. Any questions? Daniel, what's the point? There is no point. I've wasted 16 years of I meant on the graph. What's the point? On oh, the graph! The <laughs> I thought you meant like, what's the... Sorry.
sorry, that's on me. Eventually reaches the point of infinite sadness. Yo, hmm? why did your nose run, but your feet smell? Hey, get out of my sandwich. No. High five! Hundred! No! I never know what to say to someone at a funeral. I'm terrible. Just say, I'm sorry for your loss, then move on. Thank you for coming to the funeral. I'm sorry for your loss. Now move on. So your grandma keeps offering you food, even when you're not hungry. Here's how you're gonna get her back. Step one, you're gonna head straight to your grandma's house, tell her you're not hungry, and then wait until she offers you some apple pie. You then say, no grandma, I'm really not hungry, and watch as she hands you a plate of apple pie anyway. Big mistake, grandma. Step two, you grab the apple pie, take a little bite, and then smear the rest all over your hands, face, and chest. You tell grandma you're gonna need to run a little bath, and then sprint upstairs to the bathroom. Boom. You immediately spin the taps until they spin no more. The water rises out of the pipes at 100 miles per hour, and floods the room around you. The womb Lovely water rises higher and higher until you're swimming in your bathroom like a Japanese urchin hunter. Gallons of water flood through the floor and pour into the kitchen below. The bathtub crashes down onto your grandma's stove. It smashes it into blitherine. You can't cook without a kitchen, grandma, can you now? You see, when a boy isn't hungry, he simply isn't hungry. And this is the last time you'll be offering me food. Boom! And step three, you simply head back home, get into bed, and close your eyes knowing you will never have to eat with a full stomach again. Well done, mate. Justice has been served. Oh, shit. That's a dope-ass fucking car, bro. How much is it? I don't know. New? That's not how you say it. Then how do you say it, then? It's I don't knowing. Bro, it's not I don't knew or I don't knowing. Then what is it, then? I don't know. You fucking dumbass. If you didn't know, shut the fuck up then. Would you rather fight a chicken to death every time you got into your car, or an orangutan to death once a year, but you get a sword? Sir, we meant questions about the job. Oh, okay. You either need to back me the fuck up! <laughs> or shut the fuck up. <laughs> got it? You had me at hello. <laughs> Any last words? If you shoot me, your penis is small. Fuck. Ah, see, gotcha. I see what you Let me see. What? Nothing. Now, Stephen, today I'm here as your lawyer, okay? That means you're protected under client confidentiality, okay? Anything you tell me, I can't repeat to anyone without your permission, okay? Do you understand? Yes. Okay, now that that's out of the way, did you do it? Did I sleep with your wife? What? No. No. No? Well, now I am a little curious. Did you sleep with my wife? Yeah, well, well no. Um, I have been sleeping with her for the last two years, regularly. Oh, you were talking about the arson that I'm on trial for. What are you doing? I am calling Jessica. Did I give you permission to do that? No, you didn't. Okay, so back on the subject of arson, I actually didn't do that. Do you have an alibi? Yes, I was at your house. And is there someone that can confirm you were at my house? Yes, there is. And can they confirm your whereabouts for the whole night? And most of the next morning. He got himself a lift without any hesitation. Driver said, where are you going? I don't have a destination. He said, that's pretty weird. Why would you order a car if you don't know where you're gonna go? Are you stupid or something? What the f*** is wrong with you? Why is there a port car on the ceiling? You said bring my grades up. Hey, man. Hey, Max. What's going on? So, I got good news, and I got bad news. Okay, give me the bad news. It's not gonna make much sense. I'm a man! I can take the bad news! Give me the bad news! Well, it died on the way here. What is that? Well, what's the good news? You know that bird you wanted for your birthday? Yeah? Well, I got it! No! Yeah! <laughs> Thanks, man. Wait, hold Hey, so I just had this weird dream and I thought I should tell you because it felt so real. You were sleeping with my girlfriend and then you also had this weird thing where you, you kept putting Lego in your mouth. That's so weird. My dad just texted me that I uh, need to come home and have a meeting with him and mom because apparently she was diagnosed with cancer this morning.
Wait a second. Cancer? Cancer? Can sure try to fit these nuts in your mouth? Okay, okay, Dad. It's definitely gonna be a D's nuts joke. <laughs> Don't go in the basement. Wait, don't go in there? No! You never go to the basement. Okay. Thanks for the help. No problem. I'll just try this door. Hey. Oh, come on, don't grab the remote. Why not? Hey, why aren't koalas considered bears? Because they're marsupials. Because they're marsupials. No, it's because they don't have the right qualifications. Hey, that last piece is mine. Uh, look out, a murderer. What? Oh! You better watch it, buddy. Holy shit, sorry. You have one more wish. One more wish? I, I don't even know what to think of. Dude, think of all the good we could do with this one wish. World peace, end world hunger, no more war. You're right. Genie, I'm ready for my last wish. Go on. I wish for an anime girlfriend. I am a genie, you have three wishes. No way, oh, I got the perfect wish. Okay. Okay, so I wish that every time I reach in my pocket, I pull out a hundred dollars. All right. Yes. All right, let's see. Oh. <laughs> it works. Wait, someone broke into my house. I'm calling the police. What? Hi, sorry, uh, would you mind taking a picture of me? Oh yeah, for sure. Thanks. All right, ready? Oh, hang on. <laughs> Hi, who's this? Uh, whoa, 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 calm down. What happened? Who is it? Oh my God. Yeah, of course. All right, thanks for the call. My grandma just died. Your grandma? Yeah, my, gr no, wait, no, it must've been your grandma. <laughs> oh, yes, yeah, sorry. That makes more sense, right. Oh, that's a relief. <laughs> I thought my grandma just died. <laughs> oh, thank goodness for that. <laughs> oh, all right, there's a few good ones there. <laughs> what? Gun to your head, what are your last words? Yes! 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 Oh my God, yes! Finally, bitch! Finally! <laughs> <laughs> oh, step on a crack, break your mom's back! I love my mom. Step on a crack break, a sex offender's back! Oh. Alright, alright, ten more seconds, come on guys! If any of you come down, I'll make a personal promise to make your life hell! Ten! Nine! Hey, sir, did you just come down? I'm sorry, sir, I just couldn't hold it any longer. Oh, no, that's okay, we all make mistakes. Just not in my class. Now, who else wants to come down? You, sir, what's your reason for being here? Um, I don't, I don't know. I'm, so, I'm sorry, you don't what? I, I just don't know. Well, you better know soon. No, please don't shoot me. Now, answer me. Why are you doing this? I really don't know, sir. Please spare me. You better come up with an answer. I really don't know. Is it your family? Maybe, I, I don't know. Is it your friends? Maybe, sir. Is it your physical well-being? It could be. Oh, what is it, son? Speak up. No, I want to get to 169 pounds, sir. What? 169 pounds for the memes, sir. For the what? The memes. Everyone come down. Aesthetic. <laughs> ah. Hey, can you catch a spider for me? Oh, yeah, sure. Oh, great. Still think puns are just harmless fun? That man is dead. Nurse, my dick hurt. I know you're in pain, but let's not use that language, please, young man. No, it's my friend Richard. Help me, nurse, I'm in pain. Oh gosh, okay, calm down, what's the problem? My dick hurt, nurse! Oh, shit, I'm not getting any service. You? Of course, damn it. 
No juice. Phone's dead. I just smashed my phone with a hammer. Guys, my phone's a book. Your neighbor's stolen your recycling bin and now you want it back. Well, here's what you're gonna do. Step one, you're gonna call your neighbor and tell him there's a female blunder wolf let loose in the local area. You're gonna tell him a blunder wolf is a half female, half wolf lizard hybrid that recently escaped a German science lab. It's basically been going around tearing people into blitherines. And if you wanna survive, I'm gonna have to come and border up your house. Okay, boom. Step two, you go around his house and border up every window and every door until it's completely pitch black inside. And once it is, you strike. <laughs> You sprint through the house at top speed, screeching like the legendary Blunderwolf. You load yourself off the kitchen table and latch onto your neighbor's back. <laughs> Blunderwolf hungry. Your neighbor immediately cries out, Please, Blunderwolf, please don't kill me. Tell me what you need. The recycling bins, the recycling bins, that's the only way. Your neighbor's heart pounds through his chest as he races to the garage. He opens the garage door, grabs the recycling bin, and throws it outside. You then launch off his back out of the garage and grab the recycling bin, and then boom! You just get the recycling bin, put it out the front of your house, and then carry out your day as normal. Well done, mate. Justice has been served. Can I have the salt? Mm. Oh, what's the magic word? Abracadabra? That's better. Holy shit, Himalayan. Yeah. Nice. All right, sir, go ahead and order whenever you're ready. Uh, can I have the bacon cheeseburger? Oh, I'm sorry. I don't think we have that on our menu. No, I thought I read the, yeah, see here. Okay, well, it's called the Big Daddy's Meat Burger? I'm sorry, what was that? The Big Daddy's Meat Burger. Ooh, we're actually all out of Big Daddy's Meat. Is there anything else on the menu I can interest you in? Um, I'll just have a chicken sandwich. I'm sorry? This, right there, what that says. I'm actually blind, sir. You're gonna have to read that out loud to me. The, mm, the chickeny split, ooey gooey, easy peasy, chucky cheesy, asterisk, Baby voice. I'm not doing a baby voice. Do the voice or starve. Yummy, jummy in my hungry tummy, world famous breaded chicken book book sandwich. Okay, one cock sandwich coming right up. <laughs> what? Ma, I want you to meet my girlfriend. Oh, hi, it's so nice to meet you. So nice to meet you too. Ah, you're really pretty. Oh, um, thank you. Of course. Um, did you know that he used to eat his own shit? Where the hell have you been? Went for a drink with my brother. Liar! Prove it! Because he's here in bed with me! So who is this slut you've been seeing? Hey, you wanna do a trust fall? Sure. Alright, fall backwards. Alright. Aren't you supposed to be behind me? Do you trust me? Uh, yeah. Do I you trust me? Okay. Oh, it's a mattress. I knew I could trust you. Well, what's your problem? No problem. That's my problem. And what's the problem? I'm a problem solver. I need a problem to solve. Okay, your finances. Did you solve that? Oh, yeah. No problem. Okay, well, do you get enough sleep at yeah. night? No major insecurities? Yeah. You're happy with your family yeah. life? You're healthy? It, done. I've solved all of those. Well, you've solved all your basic problems. Now you need fulfillment. But I got my fulfillment solving the basic problems. And why aren't you fulfilled? Because I ran out of problems. Well, that's problematic. Probably. No, definitely. That is a problem to solve. What is? Having no problem to solve. Well, how do I solve the problem of having no problems? Well, that's not my problem. It, what's your problem? I swear to God, steal one more of my cooking utensils, we're done. Our relationship is over. <laughs> well, that's a whisk I'm willing to take. That is when I stole his AirPods. Shh, dude, shut the fuck up. Oh, sorry. And that's when I stole his AirPods. Whispering it doesn't change the fact you just yelled it out loud. <laughs> yes, it does. That's not how it works, dude. Watch and learn. Hey boys, come downstairs, dinner's ready. Mom, I lied to you about wanting to go to college. I just tell you that to make you feel better. What? You don't want to go to college? Are you serious? For three years now, you've been lying. Now watch Are you this. actually serious? I lied yeah, to you about wanting you know, to go to college. I just tell you that to make you feel I don't want to hear this brought up ever. That's, that's weird, I, I forgot what I was saying. What? No way, it actually worked. Pretty cool, right? <laughs> yeah. Want to give it a try? Mom, dad's been cheating on you with Melissa. <gasps> Cheating on you with Melissa. Uh, hey, hey dude, I, I don't think it worked. Yeah, that's that's cause it didn't. Um, April Fools. Oh. This is my boyfriend Derek. This is Derek's boyfriend Ben. Wait, sorry, what's the situation? Derek is gay, but he's straight for me. But he's gay for Ben, and Ben's really gay for Derek. And I hate Ben. It's not that complicated. This pic of us is so cute. I'm posting it on Instagram. Oh, uh, don't post that. I'm so ugly. Who ugly? What, what just happened? Did you just say my best friend was ugly? What? It, it's me. I, my best friend is beautiful. Don't you know that? 
Where's this music coming from? I think you need your eyes fixed, bestie. Let me take care of that. Whoa, whoa! How's the girlfriend? I don't have a girlfriend. I know. I'm just reminding you. You should see me in the car. How's your mom? Yo, can you arrest me so I can sit with my best friend? Dude, shut the fuck up, bro. Shut the fuck up. It's not even a joke anymore, bro. It's never been a joke. Are you, are you guys... Did you all right, and before you give me any of your wishes, I've heard it all. Don't wish for more wishes. I don't want to bring anyone back from the dead, and I can't kill anybody, okay? That's it? Those are your only rules? Why are you saying it like that? Yes, those are my only rules. No, no, no reason. No reason at all. What are you writing down? What are you doing? What's going on here? I'm just making a list of some things that I want. That's like seven things already. I told you, don't wish for more wishes. I'm not wishing for more wishes. Um, so I wish that everything on this piece of paper would come true. You son of a bitch! Psst. Want some drugs? Depends. You sell them? Depends. You buying? Depends. You a cop? Depends. Are you a cop? No. Well, all right then. All right. You have arrest. When your friend tells you to do something, uh, you're not my dad. When your dad tells you to do something, dad, you came back, son. Just pass the fucking remote. Okay, guys, he's gone. What do we do? Let's break through the window. No, he'll just be waiting for us upstairs. What if we all pretend to be dead? Then when he buries us, we'll just escape through the ground. No, we'll suffocate before we even escape. How about we hit the wall down? No, he'll hear us before we even break through. And plus, this is a basement, so we're underground. What if I use my advanced bird mating call to summon an army of birds to break us out? Good idea. But again, this is a basement, so the birds won't hear you. Threesome! Forget about it. What if we just pretend that we lost our memory, then he comes back and thinks that we're- GUYS! It's four against one, right? So why don't we just wait for him to come back and attack him as a team? That's a... Horrible plan. Yeah, what are you thinking? Dumbest plan so I've stupid. ever heard. Exactly. Why we don't not gonna happen. Hey, can you remind me that you don't hate me? Because <laughs> I get insecure very easily. What's the problem? You like it, you know. The teachers are nice, but the principal, complete idiot. Do you know who I am? Uh, no. The principal's son. Oh well. Do you know who I am? <laughs> no. Good. <laughs> hey, wake up. You're free to go. What? Why? Somebody bailed you out. What? But I don't. I don't even know anyone. Who the fuck are you? Emmett? Okay, Emmett, did you bail me out of jail? Yeah. Well, why? I wanted to show you my hat. You bailed me out of jail because you wanted to show me your hat. Yeah, I just bought it. Wasn't my bail like $20,000? 25. So do you like no, it? No, not really. No. Fuck. Hey, Mom, I want you to meet my girlfriend. Oh, hi, it's so nice to meet you. It's so nice to meet you, too. Ah, oh, you're really pretty. Oh, um, thank you. Of course, um, did you know that he used to eat his own shit? Man, look at this fucking guy running. What the fuck are you running for? Somebody chasing you or something? Oh fuck, we're chasing him! Took my food! Jason! That was me 10 minutes ago. I was mad, but friendship is more important. That was me 15 seconds ago. Screw it! Jason! If you press that button, it'll take one year off of your life. But you'll get a hundred thousand dollars. Dude, stop! Stop it! Um, hello? I don't know who you are. This is Ike. I will find you. This is not Ike. Hey, son. Yeah, Dad? Uh, me and your mom need to talk with you, so be in the living room. Oh, really? 
Yeah, yeah, I'll, I'll be there. It's just, uh, um, could I finish this game first? I'm so close. Sure, but uh, make it quick, okay? You got it. My time has come. They figured out I'm not the innocent Christian boy they thought I was. What a shame. Years of secrets all comes down to this. It was a good run, but whatever they know about me now is irrelevant. I must use these final moments to my advantage. With only two years till my 18th birthday, victory is practically in the palm of my hands. I've tried my best to be the good guy, but I did what I had to do. I was cautious, but unfortunately nobody's perfect. Why must life be so cruel? Why must I have to face this alone? Whatever happens next is for fate to decide. I have nothing to hide. I have nothing to protect. I am an open book. But at what cost? That we will see. You needed me? Grandma died. <laughs> yes! What? Yo, want a ding dong ditch a completely random house? Yeah! Let's do it! Okay. Which one should we do? Uh. Let's do that one. Well, bud. Doesn't look like anyone's gonna show up to your birthday party this year. Again. I'm sorry. Yeah, I know. Hey, but maybe next year. Yeah, probably not. But hey, at least we got all this birthday cake to ourselves now, right? Yeah, that's true, I guess. And you did get chocolate cake again this year. I'm still allergic to chocolate, but yeah. Hey, teacher, when are we actually going to use any of this? You? N never. I need people to understand that if I text you H-E-H-E, -E, it's not <laughs> it's <laughs> It is not <laughs> it's <laughs> Hey, me and you, we got to talk. Uh, sure, um, w w what's up? Did you kill my father? I'm sorry. Look, I promise it will never happen again. Well, of course it won't happen again. That's the point. Hi there. Were you ready to order? Hi. Uh, I'll just have the usual. Thanks. Do I know you? No. Okay. Yeah, I didn't think so. So then why the fuck would I know what the usual is for you? It's on the menu. It says it's just a chicken sandwich with... Roasted red peppers and spicy. Oh, I'm I'm so sorry. I completely forgot that's what we called that. No, okay. It, that's okay. Great. So Don't worry about it. And what did you want to drink with that? Uh yeah, I'll have whatever it takes to get you out of my face. Excuse excuse me? What the fuck did you just say to me? <laughs> no, it's on the it's on the menu. It says it's just a water with lemon. Oh gosh, I am so sorry. I keep no, it's, forgetting. It's okay. Say it! I don't want to. Say it! <laughs> Two best friends in a row. They, they might kiss. Good. <laughs> yes, we will. Now kiss. I don't, I don't, I don't want to. Kiss! <laughs> 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 All right, bro. Truth or dare? <laughs> dare. I dare you to tell me your social security. Okay, never mind. Pick truth. What's your social security? And something a burglar would not want to see when he breaks into a house. Neck, huh? I don't want to see that either. Woo! Your sister finished all the milk this morning. Well, here's how you're going to get her back. Step one, you're going to tell your sister Vin Diesel's at your house for a family reunion. Tell her Vin he's making a big old bowl of bolognese. And if your sister wants a plate, she better get back home ASAP. And tell her to bring some chilies. Vinny loves chilies. Step two, your sister arrives, says hi to Vinny, tells him he definitely could beat up Dwayne The Rock Johnson if he really wanted to, and then hands him a big old bag of chilies. Boom. Step three, you grab the bag of chilies and throw them into Vin Diesel's mouth, causing him to immediately fall to the ground in anaphylactic shock. Wait a minute, Vin Diesel doesn't love chilies. He hates chilies. If we don't get him some milk right now, Vin Diesel might die. Quickly, sister, run to the fridge and grab some milk. Quickly now, quickly, oh wait. You finished all the milk this morning, didn't you now? You selfish bastard. You finished all the milk and now Vin Diesel is dead. You didn't think about that one now, did you? You just didn't think. Boom. Now, step four, your murdering sister simply looks down at Vin Diesel's lifeless body and begins to cry her eyes out. She vows to never finish the milk again, and you walk out of there with a smile on your face. Well done, mate. 
justice has been served. <laughs> what are you doing in my house? What are you doing in my house? I want waffle fries. Why are you late? Yeah, remember when you told me yesterday that the bell does not dismiss you, I dismiss you? Yeah, what about it? Well, if the bell does not dismiss me, it does not tell me when to get here on time. Get out of my class, Ryan. Why? Because I was five minutes late? You weren't even in class yesterday. I know, but that's not important. Well, yeah, it is. It's way more important for you to be here than us. The substitute gave you homework yesterday. Put it on my desk on your way out. I finished it in class yesterday. I put it on your desk. Ryan, why are your answers from question one all the way to question eight exactly the same as Michael's answers? Oh, I don't know. Maybe because we were answering the same questions? Can you believe this? Oh, by the way, toss me pencil. Hey, no talking to each other during class. Why are you teaching during my conversation? That's it. To the principal's office now. Fine. Can I go to the bathroom on the way? What for? To open the chamber of secrets. What do you think? Out! Okay, what does A stand for? Arson. Oh, you're so good. Okay, B. What does B stand for? Barson. <laughs> what stands for C? Commit arson. Ooh. D. Don't come near me. I'm going to commit arson. <laughs> I raised you real well. Hey, you must be the new guy. My name's Tom Richardson. Oh, nice to meet you, Tom. Bend over. Excuse me? Bend over. Listen, buddy, I don't just bend over for people I just met, okay? I don't even know your name. Bend over. You stay away from me, man, okay? Yo, can you arrest me so I can sit with my best friend? Dude, shut the fuck up, bro. Shut the fuck up. It's not even a joke anymore, bro. It's never been a joke. Are you- are you guys stupid? What's wrong, Blind Adam? Fucking Stacy. Oh no, what happened? She said it's over. Damn, man, I'm sorry. It's cool. I'll be okay. Did she say why she was breaking up with you? She sure did. W what, what was the reason? She said I'm always looking at other girls. Wait a minute. Who are you? What? Who are you calling? What are, what are you? What are you doing? Are you? Are you calling? Are you calling? What is, what are you huh? doing? Stacy? Yeah. Bitch, I am blind. Sister's boyfriend keeps stealing your Calvin Klein underwear. Well, here's how you're gonna get him back. Step one, you're gonna tell your sister it's your pet turtle Tyson's birthday. You wanna go bowling this weekend to celebrate, and she should come and tag along too, and bring a boyfriend, Lamar. It's gonna be a turtle tastic time. Step two, everyone arrives and gets ready to bowl. You look over to Lamar and say, "I'm hungry. I want a hot dog." You feel me? Boom. Lamar turns around to grab your hot dog, and you immediately sprint over to a bowling ball. You fill one of the finger holes with industrial strength, quick drying super glue, and pass it back to Lamar. Quickly, Lamar, it's your turn to build. Lamar launches the bowling ball. His body, attached by the super glue, flies along with it. You latch onto his trousers and underwear like a fucking hellhound and use his own momentum to tear them from his body as he flies. Boom! Then, look. You just check the label of his underwear, see if they are yours, and if they are, you take him on home. Well done, mate. You just got your pants back. Officer, that's the person who's British unironically. Take them away. Shit. Charles, they found us. I am aware. Deploy the accents. Of course. Oui, oui. Uh -huh. Mon ami. Bonjour. Charlie. Hola. Uh -oh. Hey, bro. Yeah, bro? Close your eyes, bro. Okay, bro. What do you see, bro? N nothing, bro. That's my world without you, bro. Bro. I have a question. Okay. Have you ever heard of Stranger Danger? No. Perfect. Sir, I'm sorry, but we're going to have to ask you to leave. Why? Do you really want to know? Yes. Your vibes are off. When your friend tells you to do something? Uh, you're not my dad. When your dad tells you to do something? Dad? You came back. Son. Just pass the fucking remote. Hey, can you remind me that you don't hate me? Because <laughs> I get insecure very easily. What's the problem? Hey, look, that cloud looks like a freaking potato. Hey, look, that guy looks like a fucking loser. Oh, man, come on. Dun, dun. Hey, mom. Have you been crying? Don't worry, I just get like this when the seasons change and the uh, flowers pop up. Oh look, it's the ugly stinky boy back in my garden this year. Oh, what are you gonna cry and make a TikTok about it? Dad. You right, son? I can't get to sleep. There's a monster living under my bed. Monsters don't live right under your bed. They live in your mind, in the back of your head. Your brain's like a sponge, especially while you're young. It's soaking up trauma, which is not very fun. And as you grow older and learn that life's not quite fair, that's when these great demons 
come out of their lair. Manifesting as anxiety and sometimes depression, these feelings will have you in their possession. There's nothing under your bed, tonight you'll survive. But be afraid of those monsters that'll eat you alive. Good night. You should listen to your dad, he's a smart man. I'll probably never get married. You know, I actually married my best friend. Really? Don't even think about it. We don't have to do it, but I'm still gonna think about it. See what you started. Ten minutes, swear to God. You can play with this kaleidoscope I got you at the airport. What? A kaleidoscope? I'm not five. Shapes and colors, the likes of which I've never seen. Where the hell have you been? Went for a drink with my brother. Liar! Prove it! Because he's here in bed with me! So who is this slut you've been seeing? Hey, you wanna do a trust fall? Sure. Alright, fall backwards. Alright. Aren't you supposed to be behind me? Do you trust me? Uh, yeah. Do I you trust me? Okay. Oh, it's a mattress. I knew I could trust Mom, I want you to meet my girlfriend. Oh, hi, it's so nice to meet you. So nice to meet you too. Ah, oh, you're really pretty. Oh, um, thank you. Of course, um, did you know that he used to eat his own shit? Hey son, can you uh, take out the trash? Oh yeah, mom, of course. Let me just uh, finish up this essay real quick. Huh, I asked you to do one thing, but it's all right, it's cool. But when I'm dead, buried, deceased, gone, you gonna miss me. I'm coming. I'm coming. I just murdered your wife and kids, and now I'm gonna kill you. Please, sir, don't shoot me. I, I have a wife. I, I have kids. But I don't care that you... Uh, did you not hear what I just said? 911, what's your emergency? Sorry, is that Susie? Jason? Yeah. Oh my god, how are you? Not so good right now, yeah. Give me a moment, old friend. Take your time. There is a snake in your bathtub. Oh yeah, that's my pet snake, Ron. I have a pet snake? Why do you name him Ron? I named him after Ron Weasley from Harry Potter. Why didn't you just name him after the snake that's in the movie? I thought Ron was a cooler name. Okay, anyway, you're lucky he's not venomous because he could have killed me. Oh no, he is venomous. You have a venomous snake in your bed? Why is he not in a cage? He hasn't bitten anyone yet. Oh. Well, how long have you had him for? I bought him like... Two and a half hours ago? Boy, I'm gonna beat your ass! Any last words? If you shoot me, your penis is small. Fuck. I see. Mm, gotcha. I see what you. Let me see. What? Nothing. What's happening? Is everything okay? No, it's not okay. A freaking tarantula almost bit my freaking arm off. And make you do something, I'm scared. Well, right there. Right freaking there, are you blind? Are you talking about that? The itsy bitsy spider? Yeah. Wow, ladies. All right, fine, I'll squish it. No, don't eat it! Hey, Dad, uh, now that Grandpa's dead, can I have his boat? Is that all you really care about? Jeez, Dad, it was a joke. Uh, I'm just kidding. You better be. Because I'm getting that boat. So, if your cousin's stolen your trainers and you want to get them back, well, here's what you're going to do. Step one, you're going to plan a little vacation somewhere with a big f***ing mountain. Somewhere like Ben Nevis, which is a big old mountain somewhere in the UK. I don't know where it is. I don't really care where it is. You're just going to have to figure that out and go there with your cousin. But you're also going to bring someone else. Your grandma. What your cousin didn't realize while stealing your trainers is that you guys share the same grandma. And that innocent little grandma you share will now become a powerful tool in your plot to return your trainers. Hmm. You take your cousin and your nan to Ben Nevis. And when you get there, you plan a little picnic. At the peak of the mountain. Then you and your cousin are gonna wheel your grandma to the very top of that mountain, pull out the picnic basket, ask your cousin to start preparing the sandwiches, and roll your grandma right to the very f***ing edge. You're gonna flick down your shades, turn on your Bluetooth speaker, and sing the following. Cut my life into pieces, this is my last resort. I'll push Nan off this mountain if you don't give me my trainers. Then you're just gonna sit back and relax while your cousin gives you your trainers back, jump on the back of your nan's wheelchair and skateboard down the side of the mountain like Tony Hawk's. My trainers. Unpopular opinion. Stop telling women on the internet how beautiful they are and go say it to your wife. Hey babe, just wanna let you know that uh, women on the internet are beautiful. Promise to do exactly as I say. No questions asked. I promise. I want you to walk like a dog with an itchy butt. I shouldn't have promised. Okay, so someone stole your water bottle at the gym. Well, here's how you're gonna get it back. Step one, you're gonna strip naked, go to the showers, and lather yourself up in shower gel. You're gonna need a lot. So head to the lockers, check if any of them are still open, and grab as much shower gel as you can. Step two, you're gonna lock every single door inside of that gym. Now, you need to be quick because you're naked, but I believe in you. Step three, you're gonna light a match and hold it up to the smoke detector, and then scream, fire, 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 
fire. Everyone's gonna burn alive. Boom. The staff will now set up the sprinkler system in the ceiling. This should quickly soak the ground and everything around it. Now, step four, you're gonna lather yourself with the shower gel underneath the sprinkler system. Run as fast as you can and dive into the ground. You smash into their legs at 60 miles per hour, causing them to fold and crumble before you. You then grab your water bottle with one hand and use your other hand to grab a piece of gym equipment and swing using your momentum out of an open window. And you then land perfectly on both feet, water bottle in hand, and walk yourself home. Well done, my friend. Mission complete.